Hi there, welcome to this tutorial from Rithus.com where we are going to look at an important class in Java, a tree map. Uh, tree map, uh, let's just see what a tree map is first. Uh, if you look at the tree map uh, class in Java, I'm looking at the class from the JDK, it implements a class called a navigable map and the navigable map extends sorted map and the sorted map extends map. So it's a little uh, tricky hierarchy, hierarchical change. So tree map extends uh, sorted map, which extends uh, map. So basically a tree map is a map. So a map is uh, one where we support different kinds of operations. For example, what the kinds of things which we support in a map are the operations like here. So you have a contains key, I mean you have operations to get put remove like you can get a value you can put a key value remove a key value so it allows you to put things in a key value pair so I can say put key one comma value one put key two comma value two or get the value get key two or uh, you can say remove key three so it's always based on a key value pair and all operations are based on the keys so this is basically what a map is and map has various uh, like methods interface map has various methods which would help you to read them so the uh, tree map is one of the implementations of map so tree, tree map implements the uh, map interface in a high right i mean tree map insert implements navigable map which implements sorted map which implements map so tree map implements map interface and the uh, it so it gets all the methods which are present in the map interface the uh, most famous map implementation is hash map but hash map is uh, one where the values are not stored in a sorted order uh, in a uh, in a hash map the values are sto stored in an unsorted order that is exactly where a tree map is different from a hash map a tree map on the other hand stores values in a sorted order so it sorry not the values actually the keys in a sorted order so let's get an let's get to an example so here i'm creating a tree map i'm saying new tree map this is the key and this is the value so keys of type string and values of type cricketer so what i'm doing is tree map dot put sachin comma the value so this is value and this is the key so key is sachin and the value is cricketer so Sachin and his runs. So if you print the key map at this point, you would get this output. Sachin, the key is equal to value, which is Sachin and 1400. I have implemented a, a two string method in Cricketer class, which returns that particular thing. So it prints name and the runs. So that's, uh, so it would print Sachin is equal to Sachin. Now let's say I'm trying to put Dravid into the list. So I'm putting tree map dot put Dravid, comma new creator of Dravid, comma twelve thousand. What you'd see is the way it's stored is the tree map is stored in a uh, sorted order of the keys. So Dravid and Sachin. So Dravid in terms of the keys, uh, D it starts with D and this starts with S. D comes before S. So Dravid would be put in front of Sachin. So Dravid first and then Sachin. So next I'm inserting pointing. So pointing is P, so it's between D and S. So pointing would be inserted in between. So as you can see, the tree map stores the values, the keys, the like the uh, stores the values in the sorted order of keys. So the key is the most important thing. So here Dravid, pointing and Sachin are the keys and they are stored in the sorted order of the keys. So if you insert Bradman now, you'd see that Bradman starts with B, so he even goes before the D, which is Dravid, and he becomes first in the list. So Bradman would be first in the list. So that's the uh, that's a very important thing about a tree map. Tree map allows you to be able to look at things which are in a sorted. Uh, because the key map uh, uh, stores the things in a sorted order, it allows for methods 
which allow you to get floor key ceiling key and those kind of stuff so because uh, the tree map implements the uh, navigable map interface you get a certain extra methods which are possible more than what is possible with them hash map so let's look at them right now so the tree map implements the navigable map interface and thereby it gets a few additional methods in comparison with the hash map so i'm inserting a few cricketers into the uh, into a particular uh, uh, tree map the what i've done is i've have the key as the integer and the value as cricket and the value as cricketer so i'm putting 55 comma sachin 25 comma dravid 35 comma ponting this is just a random number 5 comma bradman so now the va values are stored in the uh, order of the keys so 5 would be stored first 25 35 45 and 55 so that's the way it's stored but now we want to look at a few other methods in the tree map for example if i there's a method called lower key so the lower key gets the uh, highest key in the list which is lower than 25 so here it gets the highest key which is lower than 25 so below 25 the highest key is 5 so this is the value that is written 5 so the same thing is low floor key floor key returns the value which is lower than or equal to so that's the most important thing it's lower than or equal to so if i'm looking at 25 so lower than or equal to uh, there's a key called 25 so it returns 25 back so the higher key returns the lowest key which is greater than 35 so in the list we have these keys 5 5 uh, 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5
and also in addition to hash maps interface I mean in addition to the map interface it also implements the sorted map and the navigable map interface due to which it gets a lot of other additional methods until next time bye if you like this video show it by clicking like or commenting or sharing this video we are creating more videos on varied range of topics as we speak subscribe to stay updated thanks for watching until next time bye